Hello, welcome back to Link's birthday. Happy birthday, Link! Oh, <laughs> yuck! Oh yeah, I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna get me that money because I need some money. We're gonna play Link's birthday. Happy birthday, Link! And uh, let's see. There's lots of places now I can go to with the hammer. So where do I want to go to first? That's the question. You know what? I'm gonna try and uh, whistle back to level four. So we're gonna go over here to level four's area. Uh, level three area. Oh well, not bad. So we're gonna go to level four's area, and let's turn on our map. And I want to go south here. And we're gonna go up here. Hammer time! Boom! I am gonna grave rob. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, that requires the wrath. Okay, this is kind of intimidating looking. Whoa. Hey, stupid raft. You got me hurt more than I should. Oh, thank you. Ah, oh, get out of my way, ghosties. I could F6 out of here. Uh, get away. Wait, oh. This is... Who cares? I'm out. So... That was an intense room. You know... I'm pretty sure it could be done f perfectly. But, um... You know, rooms like that, where it's pretty... You know, where there's lots of traps. Putting enemies, especially those uh, guineas that can't be killed... Um, at least for me, really distract me, and they uh, do a good job of making me not focus on the obstacle. Why are there spikes in the overworld? So weird. Okay, I got a key! Key number one, obtained. <laughs> what? You know, I'll find the other key, but where I really want to go is up to the Sky Island. Because, uh... That'll probably get me an upgrade. And one thing I want to test out as well... I think it's the shop over here. I'm going to buy a blue potion. And see if that, uh... Fills it up all the way. So I'm going to test my theory out that I was talking about before. Since you can't really edit items in this game. Yep! So... Good! I got that for a little less expensive than buying a full blue potion. Um... So let's go up! That's a heart container piece there. And I don't know how to get there yet. Super bomb, probably. Boom! I think it's to the right. Nope, nope, nope. I'm wrong. I like the, the four colors there. That's pretty cool. Hammer time! The bridge! The bridge! Don't tell me this is a maze path. Okay. I was about to say, that'd be kind of dumb. <laughs> Let's go in here. It's either a sword upgrade or an armor upgrade. Secret Dungeon 2, Western Tower. Oh snap, we got Final Fantasy 6 music. Or 3, depending on what. What?! Is this supposed to happen? I'm confused. Ah. 
I won't want to do my turning around trick. The candle's really good against these guys. Burn, baby, burn! Burn, burn, burn! I see. And then when you kill all the enemies. Huh, that's interesting. I wonder how you're supposed to get that key. I'll worry about that later. Thanks for the fairy, I really needed it. I'm gonna kill you and get that key. Yeah, I'm so good. I opened up the door. Yep, ha ha ha. That was weird. Make me spend my money. How dare you. So, this is probably. Oh! Look, I jumped down here. Thanks for the key. Okay, that makes sense. This dungeon's a lot. Oh, I get the magic sword here. And I have three keys. Oh my. I wonder when I'm gonna get the armor upgrade, if there's an armor upgrade in this game. No, I wouldn't complain if there's an armor upgrade because, uh, you know, armor upgrade really. Oh, I don't wanna do that. Changes the, 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 the dynamic of the game. And it makes it harder to balance. Um, it can make it the game a lot easier, especially in these older versions of Zelda Classic where you can't modify enemies to do insane amounts of damage. The game becomes a lot easier when you have a... Uh... Hey look, I just wasted a key, Mom! <sighs> it becomes easier when you have the blue tunic and there's... You can't really make enemies to compensate for that. Oh my god. Magic sword. I got my own magic sword here. Crush your face with a hammer. Ah. I'll use this for now. More items means I have more items to shift through. What did I get? Oh, I got a key. Okay, I love it when I appear right on top of an item that appears after I kill all the enemies. I have to go, what did I just get? Hey. Oh, those are fire robes. They're assassinating me. I probably should use the hammer on these guys. There we go. I kill them much faster though. Ah! Get away! Get away from me! You have cooties. You have cooties. I'm gonna hammer your cooties away. Oh no! Hammer! So what does pushing these blocks do? They probably open up the door right there. You know, when I go back up the stairs, I probably have to fight all these enemies all over again. Uh, oh my gosh! Make... I'm gonna enter the ladder this way. Okay, I hate it when you go downstairs or upstairs and you're just placed in a room full of enemies that want you dead like that. And you have to like, you have very little time to just react. You just have to go boom and, and do it. Oh, snap a -roonies. Well, hello. Well, they have full hearts now. The hammer has a much better 
hitbox range than the uh, sword. It just has a slow attack. Uh, shifting through item. Ah, come on. Be a pal. This is a pretty intense dungeon. But it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it, ladies and gents. Getting that level 3 sword is definitely gonna make my journey... Uh, less on... More. It's, it's gonna be necessary. Oh my gosh. That's the problem. You really have to anticipate... Time your hammer well, or... Maybe we're just gonna walk all over you and like... You're about to swing your hammer, I'm gonna stab you. Ugh. Uh, oh. Oh, one of these invisible wall rooms. Lovely. I wanna... Let's go down the stairs. Look, another key. Okay. There we go. Ah. Uh. Hey, I didn't. S hey, I want to go up the ladder. Oh my gosh. Thanks for the magic refill. I appreciate it, you guys. Okay, this is the room's not too bad. With the hammer. Okay. Hey, look, wall masters, get away! Ah. This is a pretty big dungeon. Much bigger than the other area. I don't want to accidentally fall on the cliff. I don't think I can do anything from this position, actually. What's the purpose of this room? Yeah, I can't grapple anywhere with the lens. Yeah, nothing. Let's jump down. Okay, I fall down. So, oh, I, d I don't have a key. Is there anything? Oh, I got the compass! Yay! So there we go. I got the compass and I need to eventually come back here. I'd like to have the map. I have five hearts, so... I can take a hit, but... It's not recommended. Oh wait, the hammer. Yeah, crush your face. Ah, <clears throat> oh, cool. I fell in the right place the first time. I got a key. Oh. This dungeon sure has a lot of keys. Give me the fairy. Huh? I wanna go over there! It looks like I have to fall from there from above or something. Let's go to the left path, why not? Hey, I got the map! Very good! I don't 
refill my hit points here. <clears throat> oh yeah, I had the hammer, but you'd be kind of crazy to fight these bats with the hammer. But you can see I can clear these guys a lot easier. Yes. Oh, when? Oh yeah, since this is a version 2.5, the wind robe doesn't just teleport at a random location. I think the blue wizard robe just sent himself to death. Yeah, in earlier versions of Zelda Classic, the wind robe would just teleport to random locations. On this one, um, he teleports uh, in alignment with you. This is a strange room. So it's going upward here. Upward bound. Oh, I need another key. It makes you think that you'd get like the master key or something in this dungeon. Okay, that was kind of pointless. Okay, let's go right. Hey, look, I remember this room. So, yeah, probably gonna have to jump down. Let's kill some enemies here. Okay, that should be good. Let's get me some keys. That could be a problem with the boomerang. Is uh, charging enemies. If you hit just one of them, the other one's behind it. It'll just charge right through it, and oh, all enemies return. That's right. Oh, whoa! I solved the puzzle, and I didn't even realize it. <laughs> I love when that happens. Hey, look, another key. There's lots of places I can go now. I got a puzzle. Let's kill all the enemies first. Right. Push the push the push block. Push it for flavor. Gotta think about the block puzzle. Gotta think to think about the puzzle. I just failed it. I just failed the block. Oh, I could just went in the portal. I'm gonna think about the block puzzle. Hold up. <clears throat> I think it's okay for me to do this. Okay. And then... Yeah, nice. Okay, this one's not so bad. Give me my key. I want to go in the portal. Weep. Got it. Stop touching me. Okay, I'm gonna go up this crazy tower here. I probably should have hammer time them. Give me some money. Boom. Ugh, oh, this room. Oh, run away. Get out of here. Let's go. I'm gonna kill these guys. Ugh. Or they're gonna kill me. Ugh, oh, stop it. Ugh. Ugh. I was trying to get hearts, but it looks like, um... I'm gonna leave you alive. Yay! With one key to spare! Okay. 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 
I think I explored just for everywhere. So yeah. I got my magic sword. I'm cool. That was an interesting dungeon. That was a pretty intense dungeon too. So, unfortunately I don't remember exactly where Zelda told me where to go, but I have one key and I need to collect another key. That's okay. I want what portal will I go on? Let's go on the blue portal. Boom! It takes me to the exact same spot. Okay, I used the potion, so... Let's refill on my potion. Let's see. Yep, let's refill my potion. Okay. You know, if I really want, I could have just not have bought the second half and used the... Ref Instead of doing the half potion trick like that, just wait until I run out of potions completely. And then, um... Uh, and then I can, uh... Refill my... The potion as a whole, and that'd save a lot of me. Whoa, I shoot now! Because it's the magic sword. Yay! Finally, shooting sword. I feel like I'm playing Zelda now, for reals. I can kill you guys in one hit. Oh, what? I can't kill these guys in one hit? Oh, he made it so, uh, I think the sword beam does white sword damage. That's okay. So, let's go down first. That's a ways to go. <gasps> Jungle. You wonder why I can go as well? I could probably take on the, um... Fire Gleelock in the boss temple area. Oh, I can't go left. So let's go up first, before we go in the jungle. Welcome to the... Yeah. That confirms it. The sword beam only does half damage. That's okay. I have a sword beam. Some people prefer the sword beam doing half damage. And some people prefer the sword beam just doing regular damage. And there's my key. What do you prefer? So now I just gotta remember where level six is at. It's probably in the jungle. Welcome to the jungle. Blah, blah, blah. Fortunately, I, that's the only lyrics I know. <laughs> I'm not good at memorizing lyrics to songs. But you know what song I'm talking about. Welcome to the jungle. Blah, 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 Making a fool of myself on the internet. Is there a secret here? Always be suspicious of secrets, regardless of how little the Arthur uses them. For the Arthur may... Hey, I want to go there, but I'm too fat. Lose some weight, Link. Um, do, do. Lots of ways to go. So is the jungle supposed to have different music? Or, you know, I would think that you, uh, you know, just me personally, I would probably put the change to music for this area. That's... I just think it's kind of weird not having some cool jungle theme. You know, like, uh, from the Jungle Book, you know. The bare necessities. Do, 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 Hey, I'm humming here. I shall kill you. So this, oh, this looks like level six. I didn't explore the screen over, uh, over here. That's what happens. It's lagging. The video's been running on for a while. So, yeah, let's go back. We're gonna go to level 6. And we'll end the video there. Boom, boom, boom. Level 6. Jungle Fortress. Okay. Well, 
this ends my video. Stay tuned next time as I explore the jungle fortress. You have a nice day. Bye bye.